he's always been clever at getting to the paint and you know using his strength to, to bump guys off. And I think it, it just more so than anything, putting pressure on the defense. I think that's what he's always been doing. That cleverness, has he gained the game like in the ways that he's vocal about things? Has he made the cylinder around him? Has he given himself a protective? No, nah, I wouldn't say that he has an advantage. I think everybody uh, once they get into the lane. And they use little tricks to try to get their shots off. You know, I, I don't think this, he's any different. You know, he may bump guys off um, going to the rim, but everybody does that. You know, so I, I wouldn't say that he's found a way to, you know, just kind of play the game with it or, or cheat the rules. I wouldn't say that. I just think that, uh, you know, he has a style of play, and you know, it might not be what everybody might like to see, but it's been effective. And I don't think he's been cheating the game at all. Yeah, I'm not cheating, but like the, the mind games are like. When you can exist within the rules of the game. Yeah, cheating the game. Turn, no, turning certain dials. <laughs> yeah, that's cheating the game, right? That's what, <laughs> I didn't want to use the Yeah, but we, let's just put it that way. I don't think he does that. Uh, <laughs> uh, I think he uh, plays inside the game, plays within the rules of the game. I mean, it shit happens. I think um, referees aren't going to be perfect all game, just like players aren't. So, um, you know, I think more so than just the talk of uh, calls and officiating. It should be about how, uh, how great all of these players are on the court, how they uniquely bring something different to the table. So uh, it's been a fun, fun last couple of days.